Hello everyone, this is Craig the Tech Teacher, and today's video is brought to you by Precision Electric. Since 1983, Precision Electric has specialized in industrial automation solutions, including the sales and repair of variable frequency drives. Speaking of variable frequency drives, this video is going to cover the Lenza AC Tech SM Vector Variable Frequency Drive. We've used this drive for over a decade, and you're about to find out why. The SMV variable frequency drive can be sized up to 60 horsepower and comes in 120 volt, 240 volt, 480 volt, and 600 volt ranges. Today's video will look at the SMV's motor control capabilities. A motor can be controlled in one of three ways, standard speed control, torque control, or vector control. Out of the box, the drive comes pre-configured for speed control. Speed control allows for basic speed control of a motor using the integrated keypad at any acceleration or deceleration your machine can handle. The SMV works extremely well for power demanding applications, delivering up to 195% torque to full speed in under 8 seconds. It can also recover from 100% shock load in 0.15 seconds, and run the motor from 0 to full speed in a third of a second. We can easily start the motor by using the start key on the keypad. We can then speed up the motor by using the arrow keys on the keypad. At any time during operation, we can also reverse the motor. We can also stop the motor at any time. You'll also get flexible motor control with the SMV drive with easily configurable control modes such as PID control, vector torque control, vector speed control, and sequencer control. The SMV also supports nearly every popular communications protocol including Ethernet, expandable I.O., Modbus, DeviceNet, Profibus, and CanOpen. The SMV variable frequency drive comes in two separate types. The NEMA 1 enclosure is water drip and dust resistant, and there's also a NEMA 4X enclosure, which is dust tight and wash down duty. The wash down version of the drive even has an optional integrated disconnect. The SMV includes all of your essential inputs and outputs, including four digital inputs, one digital output, one relay output, one analog input, and one analog output. An internal power supply in the VFD can be used for all of your digital inputs, as well as installing an optional speed potentiometer. This video covered only the basics of what an SM vector variable frequency drive is capable of. If you wanna get instant pricing and availability, make sure you go to the Precision Electric website in the link below. Also, don't forget to take advantage of the free live chat and telephone support. If you like this video, make sure you like, share, and subscribe.